Hello YouTube, it's Talia here, your vegan amiga, and welcome back to my channel. Happy Easter. I'm actually recording this on Friday before Easter, but I'm going to upload it on Easter day just to fit with the theme because I could not figure out what to do for this video. And as I was browsing the aisles of Target yesterday, I came across the candy aisle and then I saw a very exciting item that I have been eyeing for so so long but have not been able to find in stores and I was so tempted to just buy like a whole bulk pack of this item because I was just desperate to try it and it is let me just whip out the whole bag it is the Smart Sweets Cola Gummies and these are vegan of course so excited to try these i have tried the other um vegan smart sweets that they have um they're okay they're not like my favorite to be honest but i thought that i would for sure like these because as you know i love anything cola flavored i literally bought a whole pack of cola flavored celsius just to try one because i couldn't find it in store i was about to do the same thing with these but thank goodness i held out a little bit because they are now in target and actually they're also in old navy randomly like i went to the old navy next to the Target, um, near the area where I live, and they had them there. I'm sure they're like way more expensive there. Actually, you know, Target, these are $3 a bag, so, and that's kind of normal for Smart Sweets because they're a little bit, it's actually normal for most vegan candy. Vegan candy is very expensive, um, which I'm hoping will change soon because Just Egg, this is, I'm kind of going off topic, but Just Egg, um, I remember when it first came out, it was like, seven or eight dollars for a little bottle and now it's gone down to like four dollars so fingers crossed that candy goes down too because actually it's better that it doesn't it's better that it stays pricey because then i won't buy it and then i won't eat candy all the time because I, and i'm very surprised that i was able to hold out and not eat this before i made this video because this was in my room all night last night and i didn't touch it so pat on my back for that um but let's just get into the video let me show you what i got because i got some really exciting things that i've never tried so let's dig right in first obviously are the smart sweets i bought two bags of these figured i would like them um and i think they were on discount if you bought two at target yeah they're originally 2.99 each but then if you bought two it's like 5.98 which i guess is with tag never mind maybe it's not a deal i don't know but i bought two um next are these yum earth organic gummy fruits um and these also are obviously all of these are going to be vegan i don't know why i keep saying that um but these come in the flavors that come in this bag are banana blast strawberry smash very very cherry and perfectly peach so these sound delightful i'm very excited to try these these are vegan, gluten-free, organic, and non-GMO, colored with real fruit and vegetable juices, manufactured and packaged in a peanut and tree nut-free facility, and made without a whole bunch of stuff. So they're allergy-friendly, basically. So if somebody has a crazy random allergy, can most likely have these. Don't quote me on that, though. I don't want to kill anybody. Next are these Vego Bears. I'm so, so, so excited I found these at Target because I found these one time at TJ Maxx randomly and I tried them and I loved them. They're so good. And then I went to go order them um, on Amazon because I bought like a bulk as well. Like, well, it was only like three pack. Um, but they didn't have the Santa Monica flavor available. They had a different one, which I tried and it was really good. But I prefer this one. So, so good. The, sh the flavors in this are banana, pineapple, and strawberry. And these are fruity gummy bears and they also have the other one that i've tried of these this brand are um like sour gummies and they're really good as well but these are definitely the best um and next two items and the last two items actually are just chocolates so i got this endangered species chocolate bar and it is in the flavor almonds sea salt and dark chocolate and it looks really really delicious Oh, actually, I should tell you the prices for all these two. That's what I meant to do because I just wanted to make a point that most vegan candy is more expensive. Um, so, like I said, for these bags, they're $2.99 each. For the Yum Earth gummies, these were $3.99 for this little bag. This is a five ounce bag. These uh, Smart Sweets bags are 1.8 ounce, 1 ounces each. 
Um, and then for the Vego Bears, these are $2.79. Oh, these are pretty cheap. Cool. And for this is four ounces. And then for the chocolate bar, this was $2.99 for a three ounce bar. And then the last thing I got, and these I actually got at Old Navy, which again, so funny that they have candy, but there was it's in the checkout line. And when I saw them, I was like, oh, perfect. I'll add this to the little uh, candy stash I have going. So these are just unreal dark chocolate coconut bars. And I've tried these before and these are so, so, so good. But these were probably the most expensive of all of them. These were, oh wait, wrong receipt because I got them from a different place. These were $3 for one little bar. I think it's way more cost effective to just buy like the bag from, I think Whole Foods sells them. Pretty sure I've seen it. It's like a, like a bag or a box or something. But um, yeah, $3 for this tiny little thing. I was shocked. They didn't even have the price out so I couldn't see before I bought them. I was still gonna buy them anyway, but I was shocked. I was like, $3 thing, but they're delicious. So I can't really be mad about it. They're kind of like Almond Joy, no mounds i guess because almond joy has almonds and mounds doesn't it yeah they're pretty much mounds but vegan and they're amazing so let's go ahead and dig into this candy because i'm very excited to try everything i'm gonna take a little thumbnail here real quick okay i got my thumbnail so let's just dig right in i'm gonna of course start out with the smart sweets because I've been the most excited to try these, so let's do, ooh, right away. It smells like something. I don't know if it's the cola. I don't know. It doesn't smell like cola to me. It smells, it's really strong. Okay, let's just, let's just try it. This is what they look like. So cute. I'm probably not focusing, but you get the picture. They're little cola bottles. Okay, let's try it. Hmm. I don't know. I don't like them. Mm -mm. There's like, it kind of tastes like. No, oh, I'm so sad. They don't taste like cola at all. Number one, which is understandable, I guess, but mouth is drooling for some reason um it tastes like lemon it's like the biggest flavor i'm getting i don't know there's some weird like flavor to it kind of tastes like it has um what is it called um what are those called the oils like essential oils that's just how strong the flavor is and it's like it coats your mouth it's kind of like perfume it's like you took a big like bite out of the air after like someone sprayed perfume you know you just got a big mouthful of perfume i don't know i'm kind of sad about that but <sighs> let's go for a tried and true i know i'm gonna like these tried before these are delicious so like i said the strawberry or the flavors are banana pineapple and strawberry so i'm sure we can guess which one is which? Okay, well, this one's obviously strawberry. A little red one. Pink one. Whatever. Mmm. Bomb. Delicious. Yum. Took away that perfumey flavor in my mouth. So that's good. Okay. I think this one's pineapple. No. Yeah, this one has to be pineapple. And then this one maybe is banana. But more orangey one. Let's see. Mm. Okay, neither of them really taste like banana to me, but I think the more yellowy one tastes more like pineapple than anything else, and then the orangey one. What does that taste like? Not banana. Maybe a little banana. 
I'm glad it doesn't taste like straight up banana though because I don't like fake banana flavored stuff. Like I like banana bread obviously because that's made like you use real banana for that but like banana candy is just blech to me. Yeah, these are good. I'm really sad about the smart sweets. I have literally been looking for those for so long. I have them up so much in my head. Oh well. That's fine. At least I tried them. At least I didn't buy a whole like 10 bag pack from Amazon. That would have been I would have been out like 30 bucks and sitting on nine and a half bags of candy. Okay. I could eat these all day. So let's stop myself before I do. Ooh, actually I don't think before I don't think they had did they? I feel like I remember them not having like a closed like when you open them, they didn't have this little like zip. I could be wrong, but I also think it's a new feature. Who knows? Okay, let's break up the gummy ness with another tried and true. The un Actually, let's go for something we haven't tried. We'll do every other because I haven't tried this one. I hadn't tried this one. Have tried, have tried, haven't tried. Okay, let's try this chocolate bar that I have not tried. This one is, like I said, from Endangered Species. So it has like a little elephant up here. I think they might all have different animals on them. But when you buy them, it says 10% of net profits to save our wildlife. So it's super cute. Love that. <gasps> I got the golden ticket. I'm just kidding. I got the golden ticket. That's a good movie. Willy Wonka. Okay. All right, let's break. Look at this beautifulness. You can see the almonds in there. Delicious dark chocolate. Okay. Mmm. I love dark chocolate and sea salt. Ooh, it's 72% cacao. Cocoa. Yum. Mm-hmm. This is good. Really good. Very dark. Very rich. Very decadent. It's definitely not like a Hershey's bar where you just like can eat the whole thing in one sitting. I mean, unless you're really into... I, I really am into dark chocolate, but I just think it's too rich for me to sit here and just devour in one sitting. Like, I already need water. But it's really, really good. Mmm. I love the crunchy almonds in there. And the salty sea salt. Mmm. It says, roasted almonds meet sea salt in our luxurious dark chocolate for a satisfying crunch. I would say that is a very great descriptor. That is exactly what I got. Yum. Wow. Very good. Very worth it. Definitely buy these. These are good. These are, I don't want to say this is bad because maybe somebody out there would like it, but it's just not my, it's just not my preference. Okay, now let's go back to gummies. These are the Yum Earth Organic Gummy Bears, I mean gummy fruits. Um, and again, the flavors are Berry Blast, Strawberry Smash, Very Very Cherry, and Perfectly Peach. I love that they all have this little, well, except for these. But... Super good. Okay. Oh, I think I got one of each in here. <gasps> oh, wow. Okay. So, like I said, I don't really like banana flavored, excuse me, things, but let's try the banana first. No. I don't like it. No. 
I don't like that one. Okay, I think this is strawberry. It's just not pleasant to like have for me. I don't know. Something about it does not, does not, no. Okay, this one, yeah, this is strawberry. Strawberry smash, there we go. Mmm. Mmm. It's like a weird middle taste. I didn't say aftertaste because it's not like after you finished, you know what I mean? It's like the beginning, it's like, ooh, and then it goes, mmm, and then the, uh, the aftertaste is like, okay. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let's go with perfectly peach. That's good. That's good. Tastes like something. I can't remember what it is, but it tastes. I need to try another one so I can. <gasps> it literally tastes like I'm eating the Yo Play like yogurts with the fruit. You know, the, like the how it had like the fruit in them inside, and you would like mix it all together. And it was like, you could see peaches of peach, peaches, pieces of peach. And that's literally what it tastes like. That's delightful. I like that. Okay, wait. Yeah, this has to be, this has to be very cherry, right? What the heck? Oh, it literally has a picture there. Yeah, very cherry. Mmm. Mmm. It kind of tastes like cough syrup. To be expected with cherry stuff. Yeah. Okay, so my favorite flavor is definitely perfectly peach. Then strawberry smash. And very cherry and banana blast are kind of both not great. So, but if you like banana or cherry stuff, you'll probably like these because it's very true to those flavors. Okay, last but not least, we're going to do the Unreal Bar. I know there's one that's like broken. This one. Okay, I'm going to need the broken one because... I don't know why. Because it's broken off and I can just grab it. Okay. I already know I like this, so. Mmm. What is like coconut in there? And then some dark chocolate. I'm pretty sure Sean likes these. He didn't like Almond Joy or Mounds in the past. But I made him try one of these and I think he really liked that. Mmm. These are so good. The full bar is like this big. This is a pretty good size. But for three dollars, no no. Mmm. It says it's made with organic coconut, organic cassava syrup, and dark chocolate. Really good. Now it says 50% less sugar than leading brand on equal weight basis. Okay, cool. So if you're looking for a less sugary candy, this is a good one. Very delicious. Has a nice bite to it. Good contrasting flavor with the chocolate against that coconut. I think it would be better with like a little almond in there just to give it a little different texture. But these are still really good. Mmm. Speaking of chocolate coconut candy, there's this one candy I love. I usually get it from Target, but of course they didn't have it there yesterday. Um, but it's from the brand Ocho. I'll find a picture of it. My camera's doing something. I'll find a picture of it and put it right here. I think I can do that. If I can't add something here, I'll just put it in the description box below. Um, Cause there are these like hard candies, excuse me, with like dark chocolate and then the inside is 
coconut just like this, but it's a hard candy. And they're like little squares, and they come in a bag. And they're so good. I think they're actually better than these. Um, but yeah, they're from the brand Ocho, and they have the ones that are coconut chocolate are vegan, but then they also have like a peanut butter jelly chocolate one, and I want to try them so bad, but they're not vegan. And they had them at Target yesterday. Um, which is such a bummer. I always like ch double check them just to see. I'm like, maybe they changed the recipe and now they are vegan, but they're not. So, such a bummer. I feel like those would taste so, so good. So, anyways, if you do see those in your local Target, definitely check them out or anywhere. I'm sure they sell them other places because um, those, those are so good. So, all of these, all of these are pretty good. Um, no, these are definitely probably my favorite. And then probably this dark chocolate with almonds and probably these unreal bars yum earth next and then <laughs> i'm sorry it's not sweet i just these did not hit these did not hit and i don't even want to eat another one because it just kind of overwhelmed my mouth they just smell you gotta just like open one and smell them like it it definitely doesn't smell like cola at all it literally smells like when i, I have this little um steamer thing for my face and I put drops of um, essential oil in there till you know like when the steam comes out it smells nice and it just feels more luxurious and that's literally what this smells like it's like a big old whiff of like essential oils I can't oh apple extract maybe that's what it is who knows and I'm sure people out there like them but these are not for me unfortunately but I'm very glad I got to try these candies out. This was so, so much fun. I'm sorry that it's not longer video. I just get, I think I've mentioned it before. I get sugared out so quickly now. I think it's because I just overdid it. When I was younger, I would just eat sweets all the time. So now when I eat even a little bit of sweets, I get really like, it just like knocks me out. I can't do it. So I gotta be done for now <laughs> um but thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it and like i said happy easter i hope you're having the best day whether you're celebrating or not whether you're with your family or your friends or just at home chilling doing whatever um i hope you're having the best sunday and please let me know in the comments what you did on this easter sunday if you did anything fun or if you just stayed at home and hung out or went to dinner or went easter egg hunting or had some candy like me let me know i'd love to see what you guys did um and also please like and subscribe if you like what you see here <laughs> and i'll see you in the next video bye guys